Oh good, he made it off the island after all. Controls are a little clunky, but we're gonna be just fine. The first real test of a champion, jumping over spikes. I hit the wrong button. Okay, the trick with a game like this is just carry momentum. Don't hit the wrong button there. We go under the fist of doom and breeze on our way to freedom. Up. Up. Oh, okay, off we go. No problem. Uh, we're gonna do the loop-de-loop -loop and ragged all in, but we're good. We can leap straight off our back. And we're so brutally crippled that we now walk like a gorilla. We're gonna go ahead and... Oh, we can't jump any... Okay. We're still okay. Tis a flesh wound. We're good. Just a flesh wound. I think I'm gonna like this game. Oh, duck. I actually got away with that. Cr uh, never mind. You can crawl. It's just you gotta make sure you're really crawling before you actually go for it. I think that's good timing. Yep. This tells you to stop. But if you stop in the wrong spot, you get turned into a pancake. I'm also having trouble jumping up this small bump, so it's all about timing. Uh-oh. So I see how it works now. We gotta go up over the crusher. And we're good. We're gonna jump off that and vault the freedom. So far, that's not too bad. Oh, what is that thing? Jump, jump, jump. Okay. It's really adorable how clunky the controls are. They really don't want to make this easy. I'm gonna speed run it from here on though. Whoops. Never mind. Oh, that's a bad spot to be run. I don't know what happened. I told him to run. Okay, this little rascal was the one that got me before. I think if I just, yeah, I gotta get a little momentum before you jump up onto it. Oh, those break, right. Well, if we get away without any injury at all, did we really succeed? Piece of cake so far. Probably don't want to fall into that one though. Oh, okay. That is a horrifying spinning razor blade. We're gonna go around that. That's a swinging bomb <laughs> contraption. We can't even walk down the stairs. What hopes do we have of avoiding all these rather dangerous obstacles? This doesn't make me feel good at all. He's very graceful in the air though. He's like an angel. I I can fly. So we're just, oh, don't go that way too far. This is why I can't have nice things. We're just gonna kind of get through that, jump over the razor blade. We're gonna fall down the stairs because this guy is as uh, coordinated as a baby deer and twice as beautiful. So if he wants to get up from the edge, we will happily uh, move on the level. I'm suspicious of that power line. Okay, could have given a little bit more of a jump. I mean, technically you could keep going. You just bleed out within 30 seconds. This time we're gonna stretch it out before doing our jump. That way we're sure to get good height. Okay, I just realized what that was. <laughs> it took an arrow to the face, but we still survived. Only minor brain damage. Luckily we don't have much of a thought process anyways. We can do without a few <laughs> hemispheres of brain. Well, this one doesn't seem like much of a puzzle. If we stand here, it misses us. And then if we walk past it, it misses us again. Hold up to climb. Oh, this is going to get really stupid. Uh-oh. Those look explosive. Okay, we're going to try and jump over both of those. Cut. No, we're not. Okay. Ah, it blew up anyway. We got a bit of glass in our legs, so that's kind of hampering us. We're going to jump over. Those take a second before they blow up anyway. And as long as I don't get hooked through my face... Oh, that looks horrifying. Okay, run. Time it, jump. We're good. Might be useful. Oh, okay. Okay, we're supposed to ride behind this. We're gonna use it as a shield, John Wick style. Okay, cool. We solved the puzzle and got a free star. The bearded wonder lives to see another day with only minor injuries. So, what do we got here? Oh, oh, it's a balloon that's gonna rise us to the top. Or something. I don't really trust that balloon anymore. Okay, so we just kind of... Oh, I see how it works. Not really, but sort of. Jump off, it says. How do I... Oh, okay. It actually... You don't get too close to that. So then you walk past the... Um, uh, I don't like where that's going. Okay, that wasn't so bad. We're going to jump on that. Jump off that because I don't trust anything in this game. That's a live grenade. Just tumbling through as they do. It really always is a good idea to listen to the stop signs in this game. I ignored one once and bad things happened. I don't think we even got hurt that time until there when he walked into the edge of the map like an idiot. I did this unlock a new hero, but I just love the way this guy falls so gracefully. So anyways, we're going to make this part look easy. We're going to go for a little... Okay, I'm not sure what was supposed to happen there. But we're okay. Those arrows pop right out. One little arrow in the lake has never been enough to stop us. So, can we duck? Okay, that was alarmingly close. Damn! That looks like a katana in a tube. So, uh, let's maybe duck under that. We're still okay. Yeah, we're fine. I've been through far worse. So, oh, that's really bad timing. 
Hit the ground. Okay. We're just getting by on this one. I think we should just take a moment and appreciate how lucky we are. Come on. You can do it. Get on there. Boing. Okay, whatever. We're taking the fun ball with this then. To the end. A catapult. Great. Crouching. Let me go. Where are we going? Good form. Straight over there and under the cannonball. So what we're not going to do now is... Lose our heads! Oh, I thought I could jump past it. I'm having a battle of wits with a cannon and I'm losing. Oh, we did it. We got up the stairs. Oh, you can just crawl right past it. Of course you could. That actually makes a lot of sense in hindsight. Okay. Okay, we got that jump down. There's a lot of these type of things and they're really not that challenging. Those you just got to get really close to before you jump. This is just going to be a leap of faith. Okay, that was scary, but we dodged the Kool-Aid. That one seems a little unpredictable, and I'm really all about it. So it's going to go up there, do a little swing. <laughs> we only lost two arms. Actually, we only lost one arm in total. We lost two half arms. That's going to be a jump. And uh, what do we just headbutt? Oh, that looks fun. Well, we're aerodynamic now. We don't have arms, and we don't need arms where we're going. I don't know he's going to crawl along. He's just going to like slide his face along the ground. Come on, you can do it. Do we need a little momentum? Okay, maybe maybe we need arms to crawl. We're making it slowly. Okay, well now we're in a bit of a problem because now if we stand up, we can at least get the star. We can still jump. Okay, we're going to jump, duck, crawl through the thing. Never mind. I can't help it. I'm so impatient. I just want to run through everything. This time we made it through with our arms intact. Which means we can solve the puzzle of the Tunnel of Spikes. This makes me nervous. Okay, is it just a crawly thing? I can hear danger. What does it mean hide? How am I just like this? But it's going to crush me. Oh, okay, time to go. Faster, 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 faster. Faster, faster. Oh, we're supposed to go under it. Surely he doesn't mind going through this experience all over again. Duck. We still got one arm. I'm pretty sure we can still crawl. Yep, he's good. Losing an arm is just punishment for being such a screw up. Oh, okay, so climbing might be a bit of a problem with one arm. Okay, now this. I'm still not sure if it's going to attack me with a gun if I'm standing up. Doesn't seem like it. Okay, time to drop into our hidey hole. <laughs> Perfect. Good form. We're going to make sure to stay down. Now that the RC car of doom has left us, we're going to vault onto our face, then onwards to freedom. Do I trust this? I guess we'll go up. I do love to watch him fly back to heaven with this mighty angel. I think this level's going to involve a helicopter, so I'm pretty excited about that. What are we supposed to, are we supposed to duck? Oh, that's not great. Uh, okay. Maybe this... <laughs> don't get rocketed in the butt. Maybe let's not go up there this time. I'm not interested in collecting stars. No, don't tell me what to do. I'm out of here. <laughs> okay, never mind. That's not the right way to go either. I guess we have to go up here. I don't... I don't understand how elevators work. Okay, I think I figured out the mystery of the elevator. So what you do is get off. While on your hands and knees, get back on. And uh, summon it to go. Don't get crushed. Don't touch a chainsaw. That thing's actually really tall. Luckily, we probably don't need both of our legs. So we can sacrifice one if need be. Don't get crushed. This guy is like a toddler. You can't do anything with him. He just kills himself no matter what you do. That's a bomb. Jump, jump, jump. Okay, we made it through that. That's the suspicious door. Okay, these I've dealt with before. You can just walk right through. Here's my long lost helicopter. Where are we going? We're going to grab that and drop. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I was probably supposed to hold on to that for a second longer. This time we're not letting go for anything. Made it. Now we can let go and fall to our death. Well, how are we back to balloons? We Oh, okay. We're, we're going up. We just had a helicopter at our disposal, but instead we're going to get speared in heart with the balloon that's going to carry us to our inevitable doom. We're going to go ahead and let go there. And now we just have to navigate with an arrow through our torso. And a very zoomed in screen. I'm not sure I love this. Do we peek over the... Yeah, let's <laughs> dive on in. Uh-oh. Oh, interesting. Okay, great. Probably want to go over here. Don't land on that arrow. That's probably going to hurt. You think your day is bad? I've got an arrow through my heart. But it was stepping on the spike in my toe that killed me. This time, don't touch the spikes. What did I just tell you? Okay, I cleared the spikes of doom that were giving me so much trouble, and that was literally the last obstacle. Is there a trick? This one seems too easy. We just jump on over that. Uh, the big ball is maybe... <laughs> okay, we knocked ourselves out by walking into a wall. We've set a new low for ourselves. That one kind of fills itself in. 
Oh good, we get to swing ourselves over the spikes. Whenever you're whenever you're ready, or just bolt yourself into the spikes. Either way is probably a perfectly acceptable plan. Clearly I'm missing something there. Okay, you just can't hold any buttons uh, once you're on there. Otherwise, he tends to yeet himself off into whatever he wants to. And this man should not be allowed to make decisions ever. I uh, didn't mean to stand up there. No, well, okay. This time we're just going to go for it. You just keep crawling and it didn't go off once there. We can't finish without one little arrow in our body. Oh, that might be bad. Stay down, stay down, stay down. No, 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 no. There we go. Now <laughs> we've succeeded a hero. I wonder if at the end of the level they just get like incinerated anyway and we get a fresh guy because he doesn't have any arrows sticking out of him. Either that or he took some time to heal. That was maybe a little reckless. Maybe we're supposed to send a barrel down to blow those up. Yeah, that makes more sense. Then you don't want to get spanked by these, so you want to move along with a pretty good pace. Then again. Then we jump the bomb, probably jump the bottle. It's actually not a lot of room to crouch down here. Yeah, that works. We're just going to keep on crawling because he's much safer when he has four uh, things, four points of contact on the ground. Because when he's on two legs, he's a little unpredictable. I feel like I'm missing something here because this jump seems really, really hard to make. Oh, okay. You just got to jump way later than you think you can. I just made it for the first time after 10 attempts. I don't know what I did differently, but now I'm really worried about dying. So we're going to cruise past the victory line in fashion on our hands and knees. We're hopefully not going to get too murdered by that thing. Are we alive still? I think we're actually okay. We just not that mobile. Well, we made it out of the wind tunnel. Are we good? Yeah, we only uh, took a few bullets. Jump over. Okay, this looks like a bit of a double jump type. Uh oh. Still not sure a good way to dismount the uh, wind tunnel thing, but that's fine. We may get eventually. Can he trigger without me? Maybe I don't... I don't know what he's doing anymore. He's just kind of walking on his face. I'm not going to jump over those. I'm going to trigger them with my face like a real uh, daredevil. Well, that one kind of stuck into his brain. Easy does it. Easy does it. Okay, then <laughs> maybe that's a bad strategy. Okay, this time we're just going to go straight up for the jumping over technique, which actually is a lot easier than I thought it would be. <laughs> but it's, never mind. I'm starting to think that some of these obstacles are actually luck based. That's definitely not just me making excuses for being bad at the game. I'm clearly awesome at this. Can I set that off without touching it? I can. Great. I thought it'd be crawling to do that. Yeah, there we go. Like that firework obstacle was throwing me for a loop for five, six tries. That thing I can just crawl past. This makes me nervous. Then again, the trick with any game is you just go with full confidence. Great. 